I'm so glad that you're here to relax, to just let go of all the heaviness and the density. And I thought maybe we could just let it go and just release the unwanted and I could send you a sweet message. <laughs> So just inviting you to get comfortable in the place and space that you are and allow all of the sounds and noises to become music for you. So whether it's your animals or my animals, allowing all of the sounds relax you deeper and deeper into this relaxation where you can just let it go and drift into the quietness in your mind and let all the thoughts go. It's amazing how good it feels to sleep and rest and to feel rejuvenated when you wake in the morning. We could start with just some light plucking, just plucking away the unwanted, just this gentle, energetic plucking. Hopefully, my air conditioning will keep you nice and cool and create this airflow so your thoughts can just move in and out or maybe some relaxing white noise for you to drift further and deeper into a state of relaxation. so much lighter already for letting that go. so much better and lighter already. So I thought maybe a light little brain massage before some messages.
see. Let's see what messages come through. So I have these rainbow bridge of vibrational color messages. Divine artwork, blissful artwork. about intuition and psychic knowing what's best for you in this now moment. So I want to focus deeply on your heart space and the message for your heart in this now moment just for you. You are the sun, your rays, your waves, they shine onto everyone. You're the sun, even, hey, you guys. It's an allowing, the feminine depiction is this allowing. You allow yourself to shine bright. You allow your waves and your rays to shine on, shine beyond. This is your vibration, your aura. This is the message from your heart, is to shine bright for yourself. Allow the wanted desires to flow for you. So I just want to tap into that frequency for you. third eye, intuition, activating the pineal gland, knowing that you're the sun, you're the sun, you're the sun, inviting you, inviting you to go stand barefoot out in the sun before 10 o'clock every morning, where you can just feel the earth, the earth force energy below your feet, and just soak up the sun rays, and remind yourself that you're the sun, Allowing your heart to open, 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 and to shine. What a beautiful message from the heart, right? <laughs> okay, let's see what's next for you. I have a feeling the angels have something beautiful for you. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I turned it over and I said, I bet the angels have something beautiful for you. And look at this. I am beautiful. I am that I am. It's another feminine depiction because you guys, you allow yourself to feel your beauty and know your beauty, whether you're a man or a woman. You just allow yourself to be supported in this earth experience. Look how everything is flowing to you through the beauty that you are. That beauty comes from knowing you're beautiful inside and out. The beauty doesn't come from other people viewing you as beautiful. It's the inner beauty. Okay, how beautiful. So tuning in to knowing that this life is beautiful and you're beautiful and tuning into that vibration that you're the sun, your waves, your rays, they shine onto everyone. Oh. Yes. Success 33. The 33 vibration of ascension, ascended master in Jesus and Allowing yourself to flow, flow like a waterfall. Feeling this waterfall of light that you are. Tuning in and tapping into the success of you. And maybe it's the success of you opening your heart space and shining, allowing yourself to become the sun. And 
And I look down to see liberation. It is a liberation. And it has the three and the four equaling seven. I know so many of you meditate and astral travel through the circles and the triangles and you see these. It's magnificent. It's the liberation of you. So I have this Angels of Atlantis. Let's see what comes forward for you from the Angels of Atlantis. invite you. I'm really excited. You guys, I have a new network. That's right. I do podcasting now, weekly podcasting. So you can join my weekly podcast and I'll have the link in the description for you. And for those of you that are not in the free discord community, there's an invite for you as well. Love the web of light. I love all of you so much. Do you hear my dog snoring? That is a full snore. Wow. And it's interesting because my cat is really chilled on the floor right here, and he's usually the one causing ruckus. interesting how my animals every time I create these energy sessions for you in these open portals whether I'm recording them or they're live my animals are right here they feel the vibration <laughs> I love that okay angels of Atlantis calling forward a message to inspire you an inspiring message to fill you with excitement about what's coming for you. Yes. Yes. Okay. There it is. Trust. So the invitation is to trust. To trust that you are attracting the vibration that you want. You can just toss out the word law. There's no more laws. It's just trusting the vibration, trusting the attraction. It's not about laws anymore. It's about trusting, trusting your gut intuition, trusting the desires of your heart, trusting that you know what's best for you. It's time to trust yourself. That's the key to moving forward. That's the open way is to trust yourself, trust your heart. Allowing any innate activations to occur for you as you trust and you elevate. And I really love that this is Archangel Uriel <laughs> with the trust. Because Archangel Uriel is the Archangel from the north, but of the systems of the earth. And we can trust this new higher vibration and this new elevated thought of trust, trusting ourselves, and that it's not about trusting the systems of the earth, it's about trusting what's what's best for us and knowing what's best for us.
that's how I've been using this really fun magazine recently. So as you're getting more and more relaxed, and I wanted to show you, I've been using this fun toy, Share the Adventure toy magazine to really invite the inner child to come out and play. Since we had the three and the four, the 34 come forward, I thought we could flip to page 34. Because the page numbers are so small, I want to be able to read it for you. Wizarding World, Wizarding World, page 34. It's all about wizards and wands and magic wands. And it's interesting because wands, magic wands in this Rainbow Bridge, that I have is all about illumination and inspiration and pure potential. So wands are all about illumination, inspiration, pure potential. So it's an invitation to your inner child, for your inner child to play and to be a wizard, to allow all of your magic to stream. wanted to tuck you into sleep, tuck you into bed ever so sweetly and softly. And I wanted to invite you to just breathe and relax and whisper all the wanted things to yourself as you drift off to sleep. Like it's this magical night before your dreams and desires come to you, allowing your inner child to dream with you, and delight yourself in the bliss of your desires. 